Hey, thanks for joining me once again. I'm your host, Eric Lane, your host for the podcast for success, Fast Lane. Hey, going into you know an area that uh, I think that needs to be talked about, we um, we oftentimes find ourselves struggling for motivation. We live our lives in a routine, so to speak. It's our comfort zone. It's what we do. We know what we like. We like what we know. And so, therefore, it becomes a comfort zone. And then we live in that routine, do the same things day in and day out. But we know sometimes that if that's not working for us, if that's not giving us what we need to our success journey, our path, then we need to change things up. Now, the the rub here is that what do you do to change things up to know that you're going in the right direction? You're not you're not going into a difficult direction, into a direction of failure, we, because we're afraid of that, right? You know, we're we're afraid of failure. We don't want to fail. You know, I gotta I gotta make sure I'm a success. I gotta make sure I'm doing the right thing. And if you're consistently, you know, winning, good. Can you win more? I'm sure you can. But if you're not winning all the time and you need a little adjustment here and there, what do you do? You listen to things like this podcast. You read books by people that are successful. You read biographies from successful people. You do the things that prompt your mind into action to do other things, to do the right things. Now, the difficulty of this is we sometimes go down certain rabbit holes. Now, the rabbit holes can be difficult because you keep going, you keep going, you keep going, you keep going. You got to ask yourself, is this where I'm going? Is this what I need? So this is the time that you look around, you look at your friends, your peers, your mentors, your family, and and think, what benefits me? What makes me, what makes me be a success? What makes me be the person that has the answers? Well, don't be afraid. No one's got all the answers. And it's, it's pretty simple to be led astray, so to speak. So when you're researching and you're doing your goal list, you're putting pencil to paper, you're writing things down, you're taking the ideas that you have recorded throughout the week, month, day, whatever it is, and you're jotting them down, you need to make sure that you're jotting down positive ideas, not cynical, pessimistic things that upset you, things that drive you off the rails. No, make sure that you are contemplating the things that make you successful, that are going to keep you in a success mode. It's a hard thing to do. Sometimes it's a hard thing to do to be in a success mode all the day all day long when you're bombarded with negative energy. The golly gee, I can't do this, I can't do that. Um you got to know you. You got to know that you can push forward and push through all the negativism. The junk that's thrown at you on television, and radio, all the propaganda, all of the things that you're you're being sold. Stay true to yourself. Stay true to who you are and keep going. And that rabbit hole needs to be one that you decide. Don't let other people dictate that. So I have a very simple message for this, and it's a short podcast tonight, 
But the simple message is be in control of your own destiny. Be in control of your own fact-finding mission, uh, your reconnaissance of success. Be in control of who you are. Don't allow others to control who you are, what you think, what you believe. Open your eyes. You could be so embedded with a belief that it is hard to argue against it. But if you yourself take a strong look at your belief system, what you believe, how you believe it, and by what measures do you believe, if you take a look at those, all of that and you question it and you think, well, maybe, just maybe, because our belief systems are so ingrained our belief systems are so set in stone, it is so hard to believe any other way. If you want to be successful, you have to you have to take a look at both sides all the time and call the play that wins for you. It's up to you. Now, um, this is going to be a short podcast. Um, I, I just wanted to get it out there and to let you know that you you are the creator of your destiny. You can will yourself to win. All you have to do is just keep on pushing. When things go bad, keep pushing. When things get grim, keep pushing. You can be a success. You are a success. All right, listen, uh, thanks for joining me on the podcast. I appreciate it. And uh, you can email me, uh, Derek at FastLanePodcast.com. You can find me on all of the podcast channels. Um, If uh, you want to share this with someone that needs a boost, feel free to do so. To be a mentor, sometimes you it's not just you having to teach or learn someone it's you giving someone hey read this book hey check this podcast hey listen to this tape hey i think you will benefit all you have to do you know it could be different formats but share if you will and I appreciate it. And with that, I'm going to say good night, good day, and uh, we will uh, we'll pick it up next week. All right, I appreciate it. Thank you very much.